Coach, thank you so much for joining us. First, uh, all, first and foremost, congratulations, Coach. Congratulations, Coach. Congratulations. congratulations. Coach. congratulations. Yeah. Yeah. Coach, yeah. Coach, come inside. Coach. Come, come, come. Yeah. Can see the side. Yeah. Yeah. He was also playing? No, 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 no. no, no. You can stay here, Coach. First and foremost, congratulations. Uh, they will have a lot of questions for you, but let me get it started first and foremost. What are your thoughts on the game? Because that was a really, really interesting tactical battle between two teams who play very different styles of football. Yes, first of all, it is a sensation because we miss uh, 15 players. And uh, last time we won this tournament uh, in King's Cup one year ago, uh, 12 players with different players. Goalkeeper not here, Yatimov not here, Nazarov our captain not here, Manu Chen not here, he has cancer. It was a very, very, how we can say that, tough game from us. But Malaysia spectators, they push. But I say before the game, boys, when we want to win here, we must make these people shut up. This is most important, that they are quiet. Our only chance is, so long we have running and going the tactically moves, when we can make these fantastic supporters a little sinking, we will have the power and Malaysia will not have the support of these fantastic supporters. Alexander. So, um, what do you think about the um, Malaysian team? Because do you have um, any potential player that you want to, to announce? I can only say that, you know, I said that also in press conference before. Yeah. Please, I don't want to speak about uh, other players from other teams. They yeah. are fantastic. You have very good players. I like uh, Captain. I like also number seven. I like these boys. They yeah. are, I like so many good players. You have a really potential in your team. I don't know why you are today. You was too much hurry. Yeah. You want hurry. You want to make first the goal. And yeah. I say, wait. They go Zepa. They go fast. We wait. And then tactically we wait for our moment and you see, we make these moments and yeah. this is high level football. And I think uh, Malaysia, from my side, you have a fantastic team and I was long time in Indonesia. You, yeah. I know your mentality, you have speed, you have character and what you have to Indonesia, you have the stadiums. <laughs> Yeah. And this is something what is very important yes. with the spectators. Yeah. Normally you must win here every second or every big team from the, like maybe someday teams like South Korea, Iran. But why I don't can say maybe also, maybe we was very tactically disciplined here. Yeah. Yeah. Now how how you feel after winning the cup? I'm a little empty. I'm a little empty because I give everything in the last days. My assistance works very good. We was in this situation. I cannot training, my assistant must make the job, but I'm lucky. I have with Gela Shekilaadze, assistant who I work 17 years from Georgia. I have with Vladimir Krunic, a fitness coach who plays it, who works in Italy, uh, sometimes by clubs in uh, Serie A in Atletico Madrid. We have with Tasso, a scout and a young new coach also. We have with Ali Beck, Tajikistan coach. We have also with Ali a fantastic goalkeeper coach, because this was number goalkeeper number three, yeah. not number one. And so I can only make all the staff and all the players a big compliment and uh, sure i'm also happy coach um tajikistan preparing for the asian cup as well in january that's a big big historic moment for tajikistan football yeah, yeah. Um, how important do you think today's victory is in building confidence heading into that massive tournament in january i think this is a big step because now uh, i bring these 15 players in big pressure yourself was pl uh, pl players you know the yeah. situation when you have concurrence, for me as coach, it's fantastic. I like that. Now I make the concurrence what I need for this. And uh, sure, we will, this 15 or maybe 14, 12 players will coming back. But you know, to win a tournament is one thing. But to play a good tournament, you need also the luck coming in the good tournament. You need also the luck to have no injuries under the tournament. And you also need a little the luck, what is very important in professional football every time to make the goals. Coach, uh, congrats to you for game tonight. Uh. And then uh, your team have uh, many young players for, for tonight game. And then how you manage for for young player to play good uh, tonight? I told you, I say that this is a very, very good question because this is not a work from today. I work with the under 17 now two years, we go to Asia Cup. I work with the under 20 two years, we go to Asia Cup. I work with the under 23 two years, we go to the Asia Cup. We go with 18, two years, and I make everything. I prepare these players, not every time with me in training. 
but you are self player you need a coach who yeah. say somebody come on boy and then you are looking oh i play with para but by if oh you grow up and i give them i say what is with you you are not tourists here you must play bring them out <laughs> this is all for it but this is coming from my education i coming from high level in germany yeah. croatian and this is something but you are all football players you know what is most important yeah, self confidence yep. yes. coach one motivation and <laughs> quality <laughs> coach one final question before we let you go you have been a manager in some of the most diverse countries on the planet from from asia to europe to to afghanistan different parts of the world you have coached and managed in where would you rank the ultra smalaya support amongst some of the best atmospheres that you've played and coached throughout your career i will say clear in germany borussia dortmund was hard yeah. this is something special yeah. but then i i must tell you honestly i don't see another one because the singing i know that you will come in yeah. you know what i mean we can speak about italy we can also speak when i was in indonesia also was fantastic i also know it afghanistan when we make the asia cup qualification in afghanistan was 28 afghanistan unbelievable but today all this preparation because you know everything the singing together the laughing together yeah. the only thing that make everything broken was us with our result, with our discipline, and with our heart yeah, and yeah, patience. True. Congratulations, so coach. Thank you so much. Thank Daniel you so much. Kassi and I'm proud. Yes, yeah, thank you so much, coach. Thank you, you must so come much. a little training next time you see them with them outside. <laughs> <center. laughs> okay, coach. Thank you so much, coach. Thank you for the invitation. Thank you. Character, character yang luar biasa. Seorang jurulatih yang penuh dengan uh, karisma, yang penuh dengan uh, kata-kata motivasi. Tetapi dia mengatakan perkara yang sama. Hari ini. Jaringan pertama itu mengurangkan sedikit suasana uh, di stadium dan itu membantu mereka sedikit. Ya, yeah, saya setuju dengan apa yang awak katakan. Ini adalah seorang coach yang mempunyai karakter yang yang berlainan. Yeah. Coach ni bukan semata-mata mencaturkan strategi, bukan yeah. mencaturkan taktikal sahaja. Tapi coach ni harus ada satu karakter yang mampu menarik player, player bermain untuk bersama-sama dengan dia. Yeah. Inilah satu kelebihan yang dia ada. pasukan Tajikistan ada. Coach yang mampu menarik player memberi bermati-matian untuk seseorang uh, Zulatih. Cuba bayangkan diri anda Nizaruddin, jika anda bermain untuk seorang karakter seperti itu, ya. sudah tentu mahu berjuang bermati-matian di atas padang. Ya, betul Kish. Sebab saya yang saya kenal diri saya lah. Saya rasa saya seorang pemain uh, yang yang akan berjuang uh, dalam padang. Dan uh, ya, kalau kita dapat lagi coach sebegini, saya rasa uh, boleh lagi akan meningkatkan performa kita dan uh, ya... Dengan uh, gaya dia pun kita tak kita boleh nampak tadi peluh dia keluar pun kita tahu dia seorang yang takkan duduk diam kan even uh, dekat bench pun dia akan akan memikirkan bagaimana untuk nak bagi tim dia nampak solid bila bermain dan uh, ya saya 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 nampak dia memang ada karakter yang kuat uh, seperti Safi cakap tadi seorang coach yang pandai uh, untuk memenangi hati player untuk bermain untuk dia itu itu saya rasa yang benda yang salah satu benda yang paling penting untuk dalam pasukan lah dan bagi saya apabila melihat ya saya teringat mendiang Ken Warden itulah terjadi kepada pasukan Selangor. Tiga tahun straight kita orang juara kerana cara dia lebih kurang sama. Player bermain untuk coach dan pasukan.